This is not financial advice. This is not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only. And everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you can get the videos as I put them out. You can see what I'm thinking, what's going on in my head. Um, you know, I, I, I'm i on Fort Lauderdale Beach. I came down here to have a beard and relax. But um, what happened was I put out a tweet about UBS. They got fined $25 million for fraud. Okay? $25 million for fraud. And, and, and the thing is, the fraudulent activities of these bad actors, the big banks, the big hedge funds, I mean, it, it's just overwhelming. And, and like, it never stops. It never stops. And, and the thing is, with a $25 million fine, is that gonna deter them? No. The only way to deter these guys is by jail time and, 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 and by taking their license away. Take away their ability to rob retail investors. Take away their ability to make money. That's the only way to deter them from these illegal activities. I mean, Three Arrows is getting liquidated. Every day, it's a new fund. Every day, it's a new bank with a new level of fraud. It just never, ever ends. I mean, it's the most ridiculous, crazy thing in the world. And all they do is give them these tiny little fines. And these tiny little fines do not act like a deterrent. If they want a deterrent to the bad behavior, they need to incarcerate these guys. They need to take away their license so they can't make money, so they can't rob retail investors. The fines are not enough, okay? Anyway, this is a short video because I was out here and I was thinking about it. Hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff, and let me know what you think the SEC and government agencies should do to stop the fraud and manipulation in the market. Yo. Have a great day. God bless. I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.